It's my great joy to honor our veterans today. We here at Liberty University seek to honor our veterans every day. Currently we have about 32,000 veterans serving around the globe and 10,000 spouses that are supporting those veterans. Over 80,000 Liberty students and graduates are now serving or have served in the military. This is the first school that I went to that actually has that spiritual connection and it's just been total life building having classes that include Jesus and, and God into your life and help you see the, the perspective of each subject in that way. Coming from Liberty, you're going to have that great backbone and that moral compass to do right and help lead other people and become a better leader than just the military can make you. They actually put God in front. And at the beginning, I, didn't, I, I was feeling uncomfortable because coming from a military background, everything, the military and Christian, you know, is, is really, really, really difficult and different. But then after, I say six months, I felt like, like I was called to be here. Like I, I, it, I didn't show to come here, I was pushed to move here. Um, and my life started. I became, um, like, I started going to church more. Um, I started uh, reading the Bible and actually getting into knowing the Lord. Being spiritually equipped for the fight, I would say is just as, if not more important than being mentally and physically equipped because physically uh, you can continue to be broken down mentally according to your buddies to your left and right, they can weigh you down more than the enemy can. And so spiritually sometimes is the last line of defense that you have and is really the first as well. Before anything else hits you, your daily life in the barracks, in the military, your spiritual component is going to be the thing that is at most attacked. More than anything else, it's your spiritual life. Liberty prepared me for basic training spiritually by just um, giving me the the knowledge of how to truly rely on Him and all that I do. Without Him, there was no way I could have gotten through basic training. You are allowed to have your Bible, and that was my crutch to lean on. Every night um, in the bay with all the girls, I would invite them to devotions. I started with none, and I ended with eight. So it was a, it was a great experience. I felt that Liberty truly had a vested interest in me becoming a student and they were really concerned about my spiritual growth. And since I've been here, uh, the students have come up to me and sh shook my hands that knew I was in the military and appreciated my service. And that's, that's all the payment I need to be shown appreciation for the service that I did. That's all the thanks that I need. Uh, I gave myself to Christ about uh, last August and ever since then my life has gone into a positive direction and that has all started with Liberty University and I have told all my friends, all my military friends and all my older friends who didn't think me, me as an older student had a future at, as a student here, uh, I've proved them wrong and the Lord has proved them wrong. Here at Liberty University we seek to honor those of you who have put your lives on the line for liberty, for justice, for freedom. We seek to honor you today. Thank you. Thank you for standing in harm's way. Thank you for literally giving your lives that today we might enjoy the freedom that God has given us. God bless you. May God continue to bless our country. May God bless America.